Okay, go talk to him. I'll get this out of the way right now, folks. Favorite zone of the entire game. Oh, this is music. It's just amazing. Yeah. Although, again, it's really good, but... God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> right here, Shinken doesn't look, exploit a little leopard glitch. Well, not like a leopard, but seesaw glitch. If you spin dash, and like just keep holding it, mm -hmm. after you launch the uh, ball into the air, when it comes back down, you'll go into that little animation like it just went off the spring, but the little wave of dust will still be behind you as if you're spin dashing, and the moment you land, you will skyrocket in the, in the direction you're facing. Hmm. It's a really great way to see. There's me fairly avoiding those spikes. Then I fail. I think he should get a fail for this. What is this? Oh, okay. Like, pretty much every time Shingen goes Super Sonic, he is exempt. I have to say, I, I kind of I kinda get it now when people say, it's like, oh, yeah, the Sonic just went Super Saiyan! This is hair. I know, look at that! Look at that! Oh, he's leaning! He the, just... the way he crossed his arms and everything, Freeman Vegeta. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, you know those spin, those spring traps? Mm -hmm. You know where there's like two springs in this really tight area, mm -hmm. and you can go back and forth. Oh, I hit the right there. Back and forth, back and forth. Yeah, I decided if somebody hits that, every time you hit one spring, a fail goes up. Like, fail, 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 fail. Yeah. I mean, who put that in the middle of the <laughs> <laughs> forest? On a mountain that's got an active volcano on the left. Who decides, you know what we should do? We should just put springs here. <laughs> One of the common questions is why are they even putting springs there? Here's where we try to do a platform trick that only I can pull off or something. Bam! Yep. Oh, but he's not done yet, folks. No, he will get up there. Really? Well, hey. So he's definitely gonna try. Excuse me showing him how. I guess not. Oh. Yeah. He was, uh, he, I mean, uh, Shingen is nothing if not hard headed. Oh, there you go! Oh. <laughs> Here. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> They are like, oh. <laughs> I have no words. Yeah, it's like <laughs> the guy gets, counting every fail. The, the guy gets points for you know persistence, tenacity. You know, by that point, even he knew he had to give up. <laughs> by the way, another poor transfer of momentum right there. I'm pretty sure he had more speed than that. I'm just gonna call out everything. <laughs> I don't care if it's fake. Oh, he's not hurt. <laughs> Not oh, you know what? which 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 uh, level was my least favorite in like of the Sonic three game? What? The one where where the top with the top on the marble garden. Yeah, I didn't like that. But... Just because yeah. the top annoyed me. I'll give you that. Marble garden. And I didn't I didn't particularly care that they care for it when they um included it in the generations. Now don't get me wrong. I liked a lot of things, but I just didn't like that particular Easter egg, or whatever you call it. Throwback? Yeah. I think... Well, I think they could have done without it. But, you know, for the sake of genera Sonic Generation's entire purpose, you know, remembering the classics and, you know, no. remembering your past. Oh, he got two right there. Yeah. I mean, for everything about remembering your past, I mean, not that they had to do it, but I'm, I'm glad that they did. Even if I didn't like it. By the way, Tails disappeared because he suddenly got the ability to manually fly for half a second. Hmm. Then he just took autopilot. Get that because we're done. Here's where we remember that touch damage is the curl with the clock. Now, the fail that's about to happen to me does not count because one thing, he led me into that. Yeah. But yeah, that won't happen. 
Now here's a little trick that me and Shin can always pull. We like to go get the invincibility stars before we go super. So that way we can look like we're super supersonic. Mm. Because normal supersonic don't have those stars. But the thing is, the glitch for activate the stars and the invincibility invincibility and then you get super five then the stars will stay on you indefinitely. That's yeah, sweet. Until you revert that is. Hey what did you think of this level? Like when you were first playing it, like first first playing. This was the level that creeped me. Mm -hmm. Not to not to say that I was scared. Mm -hmm. More of strange level to put in a cheery game, right? Yeah, it wasn't very cheery. And when when you got those things that crush you and these guys that lunge out from the bushes, it's sort of like it reminds me, that's sort of the kind of thing that comes to mind when I'm wandering in, the, in like, a dark place. Mm -hmm. Like, oh god, like, bad arm's gonna grab me. <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, like, 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 um, uh, that one, uh, uh, Resident Evil 4 game. <laughs> With the giant snake. Oh, wait, no, I'm sorry, that, that's Resident Evil 1, <laughs> dude. And yeah, yeah, that, that, that snake creep. I can't, I can't imagine. I'm not. I'm not a big fan of those things for reasons, which I would like to believe is a good reason. I, I'm scared. I am like Indiana Jones. No snakes for me. Thank you. Very Adventures much. of Tintin, Uncharted. Let's do that. Why did it have to be snakes? <laughs> All right now. Here's what we decided. We're just clean. a while back. We decided the moment we got Super Sonic, we were just gonna fly through this game. We didn't want to test your people. And then he had to go and do that. <laughs> Ultra fair. And we were about two feet away from the next checkpoint, folks, so yeah. It's gonna be a lot of guys. Oh wait, two more fails right there. Yeah. <laughs> now, here's one thing I pretty much took to heart every time I play this game. The moment the main the player one gets all of the chaos thermals. You might as well get used to setting the controller down. Because once he goes super, he's not gonna wait for you anymore. Yeah. He's gonna be all like, no, no, I wanna play this game. You hear that? Something like that. No! <laughs> it returns! <laughs> oh my god, I see. Okay. <laughs> oh man, that's a thing. Yeah. Just in time to pull off the star switch. Yep. Fail. <laughs> it was right there. I think Tails was there. Alright. So. We are in Act 2. We all know what's in Act 2. Wait. Le Pit. You know the pit. I do? Yes. And if you know the pit well enough, then you'd know that it's a nightmare. Oh well, I am The pit of spikes. The inescapable pit. The pit, if you fall in, you are, for lack of a better word, fuck. <coughs> no, no, no. Um, you got no chance. And, you know, since this pit of spikes, and if you're supersonic, you're invincible. So you just gotta wait until you time out on ring. How many times have I died in that little spike? Hey, Two thousand. Especially in versus mode, where you got the pressure of you gotta beat the other guy. Yeah. And if you take too long, then the game side is gonna like, you know, kill you both off. Oh, yeah, that's a move that that was brought into Sonic 3 as well. Trying from the very beginning. <laughs> I think we missed the check. No. Oh, like, the brawl thing. No. No? That's what you think? No. No? <laughs> so, that, what? What? There's me almost dying. <laughs> <laughs> tempting the fate of the... Like, tempting the will of the foxes right there. And there he goes, supersonic again. You know what that means, folks. Put it away. Oh, he's getting ready for this one. <laughs> he almost uh, just blindsided about that one right there. 
And folks, it's good thing he beeline for this switch right here, because that was a notorious pit right beneath us. Oh, I see. Okay. Heal the, the pit of eternal suffering. Especially if you're super. Why was it that why was was that the shield thing? Yeah. Why was it yellow? You see, there's this little color palette that Sonic is supposed to show off. It's not exactly a sign. Well, it is assigned to him, but it's not like in, say, MS Paint, where you dump paint and bucket tool. <laughs> it's more of like, this color is on screen. Thing is, when Sonic goes super, that color is programmed to go yellow. The spring shield is the same color as Sonic, so it being the same color, it's programmed to go yellow as well. That happens in um, Sonic 3 as well. No effort whatsoever. <laughs> Look at you guys. Yeah. Um. Yes. Bro? Rats and chickens. No, I was looking how I can't be safe. Ah, uh, yeah. Depression issues.